Hello and welcome to this video on the Pixel apps and in particular the class analysis function. Class analysis is a tool that efficiently shows you as the teacher pupil progress across a range of online tasks. It's been designed to collate all pupil data and through the use of RAG help you to identify strengths and areas to develop with each of your classes. The data contained within our class analysis COVID board can then be used to deploy intervention strategies to help you close the gaps in learner knowledge. From the home screen in the Maths app, selecting the Class Analysis button will bring up a Covey board. This Covey board encapsulates all of the information collected from both a student's independent study and their engagement with homework tasks. Along the top and in the top left hand corner of the window, you have a range of filter options and down the left, you will have a list of all pupils defined by the filter. Looking at the filters, this is the data for all your 11 pupils in 11NMA2 who have engaged with the algebra strand. Hovering over each result will give a better idea as to why a result is either red, amber or green. The first box assessing algebra vocabulary is currently red for student 1. This is due to student 1 not having answered more than 50% of the questions correctly. A result will not turn amber until 50% or, or more of the questions are answered correctly and will only turn green if they get 75% or more. The key gives you a reminder of these boundaries and any others used. Let's take a deep dive into why student one has only got 83% in expanding over a single bracket. By selecting the cell, it brings up another analysis window. Here you can view the last question that student one answered under each subtopic. This screen shows the question, the answer, and in the event that they got it wrong, their answer. For questions where they provided on-screen working, this will also be displayed. Depending on the answer given, you can override the automated marking by using the tick and cross button. This is useful if a student has provided the correct working and mistyped their answer. In the header of the window, you have the option to skip to another student for the same subtopic and a range of counters. The first is an engagement counter that shows how many times they have attempted the question how many minutes they've watched in video support, and whether they have read the notes. In the footer, you have the option to provide a written comment to the student for each subtopic that will then be shown the next time they attempt the selected subtopic. These analysis screens are available for all strands and topics.